I'm me and Kyle are here. We're working on the truck. This is after Thanksgiving. At the end of this video, I'll show the uh, the our Thanksgiving. Uh, so if you stick around at the end, then that's what you'll be able to see then. But uh, for now, we're working on the Mazda. Uh, we're gonna try to take this bumper off the the front bumper. I've never done one before. Uh, we're taking the unicorn off. I mean the grill. <laughs> I know. You Mazda guys know what the hell I'm talking about because you can't find these chrome grills anymore. Like I said, I'm going to pull this off because I've got I've got my black grill up there. That's the one I'm going to end up cutting for the headlights, for the Ranger headlights. I am not going to cut a chrome grill. I'm going to leave it and put it up in the top of the garage so that it can hide out and be here for later. Uh, we've already taken the screws out of the uh, blinker lights. Uh, there's another uh, body mount right here on the side on both sides that comes out we took the screw out of that one and uh we're gonna work on trying to find out where the rest of the screws are to uh, get this bumper off of here first ones we found there's two right here in the front top take the grill off and right below each headlight there's two they're 10 millimeters we're gonna pull those out real quick all right never mind we found right here on the frame right inside there's a bolt down there and then right here in the front, there's one right there, and that's on both sides. So we're gonna get those out. I'm gonna tell everybody what you we You want me did. to leave it out? Uh, this, this top one, you just gotta loosen it. Uh, we took it out, and then we realized that they're slotted on the top. The front one that's that I showed you in the front right here, that one you actually take out, and the rest of it's slotted. So it'll just, it should just slide out. Make sure you get these bottom uh, turn signal lights, the wire goes up into behind the battery and behind the other headlight and it'll unplug and then you can pop it all the way out. So now we're going to just slide this right out and that comes out. Because see, what we're doing is we're going to try to get this prepared for the new bumper. Now the new bumper doesn't come with any hardware so we're going to have to pull all the hardware off of this one in order to put it onto the new bumper that's up there. So we're gonna get to uh, looking at that. And that's basically this hardware here. You're gonna have clips, you're gonna have other bolts and whatnots. And that's what we have to try to get off of this old bumper, including, I believe we're gonna have to pull these, those sliders out as well. Cause I don't think the new bumper comes with that either. Okay, so that should be easy to do. And then it's one, two, three, four, and then the bracket comes off. Okay. All right. Well, we're going to see if we can knock all of these out and see where we are after that. All right. It really looks like I'm not doing anything, but I am. Uh, we've got the new bumper pulled out. That's going to have the chrome piece on there. But literally all of these pieces right here, it doesn't come with any of that hardware. At least this one did not. But it did come with these slide slots here and uh, some of the hardware for, for, for the sides. But we're making sure that we pop all of the hardware that we can off of this so that we can swap it over to that one. He's working on getting all those bolts out. And uh, I'm going to get started on these ones over here and uh, see how much of this we can get off. We've already got the end caps on either side waiting. And then uh, we can... Slowly get this together. We may not get this done today, but we're gonna try. All right, so here's all the pieces. There, we've got all the hardware off of it. First thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna put your end cap on. And there's these little push washers. Now we were able to manage to get three of them off. So right here, there's a center one. We're gonna put that one on first and then the other one. And then we can do some of the hardware on, on either side to get <clears throat> this bumper back together. Again, we got that one right there and we got this one pushed in right here and we got one uh, bolt and nut on this and now we're going to do two on either side. There's supposed to be a push one here but we only have one left so we're going to do these two holes on the end with these nut bolts, whatever they are. What are they called? Carriage bolts. Carriage bolts. Okay. They've got the square head under them. The square heads, yeah. So we're going to do the carriage bolts, and then whatever carriage bolts we have left, then we'll go across the front of the main part of the bumper 
to make sure that the center part of the bumper is going to hold secure. All right, remember these pieces you pulled off the other bumper. You're going to have to bend them and pinch them a little bit and then uh, and then hammer them back on. And then see, we're getting the bumper bracket. We're getting it put back into place as best we can. And I'm going to get this one on over here. All right, the problem we're having is this square right here is too big to go through the new squares that were punched. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them in my vice grips and I'm going to take a uh, grinder and I'm going to grind off a little bit of edging on both sides of this so that it'll slip down into that hole the way it needs to. Oh, and Kyle left, so Gina standing in is because uh, Gina's wife, I mean, uh, Kyle's wife said he couldn't play with me no more, so he had to go home. She hated it when your friends have to go home because wife said, come home. Oh, I got a bird in here. Never mind. Sorry, Kyle, we're talking about a bird now. Come on, birdie. Get out the shop. Get out the shop. No, he keeps going back and forth. Dang it. You see him? I don't know where he went. I don't know where he went either. But anyway. Anyway, yeah. Gina's standing in. I'm going to see if I can get these grinded down a little bit. See if I can get them to fit in there nice and, nice and neat. All right, here we go. All right. I want the compressor going. But anyway, now you can see I shaved off just enough to make it a little narrower than this one is. So yeah, now I'll be able to, uh, this will, this one fits down in there just perfect. So I'm gonna grind off some more off of these other ones. That way we can get this all put back together. All right, so once I got those pieces grinded off, everything went together fairly nicely. You still have to pinch and squeeze and pull to get everything to line up where it's supposed to. And uh, now we're gonna go ahead and slide it into there and see how it fits on there. Yeah, something hit the truck right there. We're not sure what, but that is definitely not the way the core support is supposed to be going right there. But all right, there's a, there's a slide in right here that goes for this piece here. And then same thing on that side. There, there's a right there where that opening is right there. It's gonna slide in right there. And then uh, this this horn right here goes right into there. And this one goes right into there. Now, um, we have this piece will end up sliding into a bolt that is in there already. You see that? And uh, the other side has the bolt as well. So we're going to get these slid in there. And then the other bolt goes on the bottom right here, which is on the front right there. And then, uh, of course, the body mounts. We've got those on either side. All right. There we go. Got everything bolted up, everything put in there. There's the old one. Thanks to my lovely wife. She was the assistant to help finish this project. There we go. Well, that looks pretty. Still gotta put the lights in it, but I'm done. <laughs> We're done. We're about to go inside and relax. So, uh, now, right after this uh, is our Thanksgiving video, so if you guys stayed for that, thank you very much. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Learn how to put a uh, front bumper, uh, aftermarket front bumper, on your uh, truck. And uh, have fun with your build, man. I mean, one, one step at a time, one little thing at a time. Uh, leave comments at the bottom, and uh, we'll see you guys on the next video. All right, we are officially underway for Thanksgiving. We are headed over to Gina's brother's house. And uh, that's what we're doing. We've got a bunch of food loaded up in the truck. We've got food, 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 all inside them boxes. And we got some drink. Right? <laughs> you going to talk? Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> all right. Well, we will see you when we get to uh, Sean's house. All right. We are here. This is her brother Sean's house. Trust me, he's broke. No, I'm playing. <laughs> Let's get in here and have some food. We've already got everything inside the house. Hope everybody's dressed. Woo! 
Here we got all the food in here. Trying to get it all spaced out. The ham's over in there. That plugged up. Hi. How are you doing? Good, how are you? That's one of the And they were on the field, and that's what we uh -oh. uh -oh. were on that field. <laughs> What? Why? This is going to be on um, memories for life. <laughs> Get your head up. You're just showing everybody how you bend over. Happy Thanksgiving. All right, go. I'm watching. <laughs> oh, we got this guy looking at us. That's their dog. He's normally inside. He's looking at everybody like, why can't I come inside? Aria, what you doing? What you drinking? Ooh, is that some buttermilk? Oh, juice, yummy. <laughs> That's my niece, Aria. I love you. I love you. Hey. <laughs> you got some juice? Is it good? Yeah. Say so happy Thanksgiving. She said I'm giving. What are you doing? She's giving you some more. She's giving you some more. Oh, you're so mean. <laughs> oh, we've already eaten, but here's what's... We all... That's a... Cheesecake pecan pie right there that mom made. Here's some more cheesecake she had left over, and of course, cookies and fruit cake or fruit bread. What else we got in here? A couple kinds of stuffing and dressing, mashed potatoes, bread, turkey, ham, green bean casserole, corn. Deviled eggs, fruit salad. I mean, seriously. Everybody's just in here trying to get over. What? I was ready for that. And we're all sitting around feeling stuffed. Well, down here to get ice in here to go get your uh, uh, we got ice. Do you have ice? There's ice. Well, there's ice in the door. She didn't look like you're about to pop. My father in law. <laughs> and that's Gina's mom. That's Gina's dad. And this is Gina's dad's wife. 
Yeah. That's true. Gina. I brought, remember, I brought what are you doing? doing? I'm facing you. Bring those cheeks back home. He's got the fireplace going in here. From the living room, see what everybody's doing. <laughs> Is your kitty cat? Your kitty. Okay, it's okay. It's your kitty cat. No, it's not mine. Show him what it does. Yeah, I seen it in there. Put it on the floor. Let me see. <laughs> That's too cute. <laughs> Going down in here. Well, I'm just. You're so rude I to the drink, people. During the holiday, it's the only time I drink heavy out at liquor. Oh, heavy leg. I was going to say that. No, I drink a lot of beer. I mean, I, I, well, my buddy has a lawnmower shop, and I'm the supervisor, and that's what I, I do. I go down there and sit there, and I watch him work. And, you know, they can, and he doesn't do nothing when I'm not there. See this here? Um, see it? that label on there? I made it in a couple of years, but I got to, I got to break down and do it because I got to meet. I can't go in the damn areas or nowhere yeah. without people saying, "Where's your wine? Where do you live?" <sighs> so yeah, I don't know if we're. Are we supposed to still be going one more? Are we going to wait on that? We got to go to uh, Walmart for the... Uh, I don't want to go. But we went last year, so we're going to go this year and go to the Black Friday sale. And then tomorrow we're going to go shopping some more. <laughs> Do what? Yeah, we're in a smaller town, so it's not as bad as you would like up in a bigger major city or whatever. So, I don't know. Maybe we'll film a little bit, but... If not, then I'll come back on here and just say so long. So, talk to you guys a little bit later. What are you doing? I'm looking at a baby changing thing. It looks really cool. <laughs>